All right, guys, BMW Emporium here, doing my first real video on the channel. Figured I would do um, an in-depth tutorial on how to repair BMW E46 uh, interior panels. I've got the fabric coming off, and we're going to take a look on how to fix that today. Um, I've done some other tutorials before, but it's just this going to be a little more tricky, so I'm going to get some, some footage of, of how to repair super easy all you'll be needing today is um your your go-to uh, fabric adhesive i'm i'm using uh, this 3m super 77 it seems to be pretty well rated on forums and uh, everyone i talk to says they use this so i'm going to give it a try i've never used it before myself but we'll see now excuse the camera work i've i've only got an iphone and a gopro over here so you have to make do with what i have today i don't have any fancy cameras or anything like that so Without further ado, let's just dive into it. So I actually got pretty lucky. I'm not gonna have to take off the, the whole entire panel or any, anything like that. I've seen some um, instances where like back down here, it gets all squished up and you have to take off the entire panel and basically just redo the whole thing. I got, let's see if I just put that up like that. It all lines up perfectly, which it's kind of rare. I got really lucky. In case you are wondering how to take all this stuff off though, I will be doing another video. My front A pillars, um, they're pretty bad, so I've got to take them off. I gotta like unscrew the whole thing and then um, rewrap the, the whole pillar. So I'll be doing a tutorial on that next. But for today, we're just gonna be putting an adhesive spray along the edge right here, going around and then making sure it stays put. So let's go on the GoPro and see what we can do. All right, now I'd highly recommend grabbing a piece of cardboard or some sort of thick paper. What you're going to be doing is just putting it right there to protect you from overspray. Let's just line that up. And then take your adhesive spray and then you should get a nice clean line. And then line that up. Oops, all right, so just gonna keep going down. I'm not doing this as clean as I should be, but I'll just wipe it up in a minute here. The important part is that it's all straight. There we go. We'll just keep going down. Actually, you know what? I don't even think I can really get in like that, so. Try not to get it on your fingers, it'll start sticking to the fabric and then you'll be pulling off, making more work for yourself. There we go. Now just to let that dry. There we go. I don't know if you can see that. Good. So it's all back and attached on there, it's pretty clean. I don't know how well you guys can see that. It's still a little wet. Just gotta wait for it to dry, but it actually it's sticking quite well. It's um, turned out better than I thought it would. I just got some up here, which I gotta kind of scrape off before it dries completely, but definitely works. Super easy fix. So just some adhesive spray and then something to protect you from spraying the, the headliner. And that's pretty much it. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Um, future tutorials coming up. I'll definitely keep keep you posted. I got the, again, the front A pillars next, so that'll be an even more fun project. So I gotta take those off and rewrap them. All right, thanks again for watching. See you next week.